What's up friends, Chuck here and welcome back to Monster Hunter World. Alright, there's been a, uh, a bit of improvement since last episode. Um, as you can see right here, both myself and Luna uh, are wearing the full Anjanath gear. So we'll go over that quickly. Uh, but we can see that we have the Anjanath Helm, Mail, Van Brazer's Coil and Greaves. Which also gives us um, a ability called Adrenaline. Uh, which we can see down there, set bonus skill Adrenaline. Um, which basically gives you more, it gives you like a stat bonus when you get low on health. Um, so I think the three next to it means that you need to have three Anjanath parts, um, three Anjanath armor pieces, sorry, to get that, that, uh, adrenaline. So you could hypo hypothetically put three Anjanath set pieces with two set pieces of something else and maybe get two set bonus skills. Who knows? And, uh, and then Luna is wearing, um, all the engine F stuff as well. So that is that. Uh, we can get our login bonus. Which we have done. And, as far as quests go, uh, we are up to doing the um, Zora Magdaros kind of mission where we were uh, using the ballista and all the rest of it against it. Um, as I... I think I mentioned, in previous games, these quests aren't really that particularly uh, exciting. So hopefully, hopefully they've um, made it a little bit better for this game, but we'll see. Uh, let's use a weapon we haven't used before, right? Uh, I still want to go melee if we're going to be potentially on its back and stuff rather than shooting. So let's go with... Let's go with a hunting horn. Right? Aqua bagpipe. <laughs> Why the hell not? Um... So I had my friend Richie over the other night and uh, he wanted me to fight and he said, you have to use the bagpipe. So I did. So I've used it once. Um, we'll see how well I can do. Probably not that well, I'm assuming. I did kill a Barath with it though, so that wasn't too bad. It actually worked pretty well. Um, I've always liked the weapon. I just don't like... It's kind of like the Insect Glaive where you have to get the... Um, the different colors and things, essence and things. With the this, you need to do certain attacks to get certain notes to play certain songs. And so you're not always doing the attack that you really want to do. Um, but I guess it's like anything. The more you play with it, the more little tricks and stuff you find. And you can cut those corners and things. Anyway, let's do it. Uh, events. No. Where is this quest? Investigations? No. Do we have to talk to someone? We may have to talk to someone. I think we have to talk to the guild girl. Or our, our, our buddy girl, whatever her name is. So we'll go up to the canteen. The handler. That's the one. <laughs> oh my gosh, Pod, can you believe it? It's finally happening! We chased it across the sea, got our shipwrecked by it, hunting all over the new world looking for it, and now our strange relationship with Zora Magdaros is about to reach a new plateau. We're gonna capture it, we're not. Say it with me, capture an Elder Dragon. Oh, yeah. uh, I tell you where the grandfather boarded that ship and came here with the firsts. He said he was ready to complete his mission here in the new world or die trying. He found his sapphire star to follow, like in that story. And I was always wondered what was going through his head as he crossed the sea. Zoro back to us too. Why do you think old mama brains <laughs> even understands why we're here? Why it's here? Or is it just compel? Sorry, that was a lot of tangents. I went off on there. Ah. Hey, I just realized. Hey, you know, you still haven't told me why you came to the new world. I bet you're on the run. On the run from a deadly group of Melinx assassins. That's it, isn't it? Uh, Melinx is a another type of cat, like a pelico, but they're um hostile. Nothing can stop us. Well, anyway, the base's defenses are solid. All that's left is to do the, get this operation done. Are you ready? I am fucking ready. Why do we have this? I don't know. Um, but let's do it. I think that may have been a, um, a roast. Oven roast, actually. Alright, here we go. We're doing it. Uh, let's toggle a voucher because we have five. You can't have more than five, so we may as well use one. We 
we'll have some chow. Uh, we've got a few new ingredients as well. I'm not sure if they're the same as last time, but uh, attack up medium. Pretty good. Grab that. It also gives us um, health and stamina and stuff as well, which is nice. Okay. Depart. Yes. We'll chuck an SOS flare down, um, see if someone wants to join us, but usually these Elder Dragon fights is um, kind of long and tedious, and you shoot them a lot of times with like Ballista and and and, and stuff, so I, I really hope they've improved that, because uh, the two type of quests that are super boring in the Monster Hunter series in the past are the Elder Dragon quest and the egg, um, egg quests. Now, we got a few egg quests from the chef, and I remember making fun of them when we got them. I might record one of them. Um, Help him. Just to show it. Because <laughs> hopefully they've, they've made that better as well. Quite a sight. Just wait till we're finished. Soon, I hope. Ah, the second fleet always delivers. Yar. Mm. This is gonna work. Chief! Commander! I like how for the cutscenes it doesn't have your helmet on. That's we'll really good. We'll get it ready by morning. I promise. I'll hold you to it. When the time comes, you know what to do. Shoot it in the face. The operation will commence at daybreak. <laughs> Sounds like we got our work cut out for us, eh, old man? By was next it, moonrise, was it fun to being called an old man. Be in chains. See, cockiness, it's always your downfall, right? Don't expect anything, then you can't be disappointed, right? It's my life's motto. Never expect anything, and then you can never be disappointed. And then if something does come up that's awesome, it's a surprise, and it's great. But if you expect it, and it doesn't happen, you get disappointed. Scout flitties. Okay, so it was... It was daybreak we were going to do this. I think it's still nighttime, therefore we're already boned and on the back foot. This thing is freaking huge. We also made everything... Get to your posts now! I don't know, maybe it is daytime. We also made everything, all the scaffolding and stuff, out of wood. This is basically a giant lava monster. So, you know, it's... <laughs> Wasn't it the best? And we're running around with a... With a freaking bagpipe. Okay, here we go. You can use the SOS flare. Let's do it. Why does that not save? That really annoys me. Fire the flare. We've done it. Pick up ammo from the surrounding things. It's just like every other one. Cannon ammo. Run it to a cannon. While this thing just stands there. Low cannon. Fire cannon. Hundred fifty damage. Oh, Luna fucking loads up for us as well. Oh, you can fire more than one. Oh yes. Okay. That might speed things up. Can you, can you get more than... Yep, you can get four. Can you get five? It's getting awfully close. Five. Five's the maximum. Alright, shoot that shit. I think that was six, actually. I, I said five was the maximum because um, the number five was orange. So I, I, it's getting super close. <laughs> we should probably move? Maybe? No? 
Keep going? Okay. What, why are you being annoying? I don't even have slinger ammo, so I can't even shoot that thing. Now it's going back. Oh, no, it's not. Never mind. Okay, we're out of ammo. Probably want to move away from that hand. There we go. Can we hit it? Get up, dude. Get up. Yes! 13 damage. We've done it. <laughs> uh... Probably want to get some movement speed off. Sounds like a good, a good idea. Reload. Do we actually have to bring... Yep, we do. Uh, swap it with that. That'll do. Uh, the blister is now dead. That's a shame. We got this one, though. Fuck off, bird. Okay, this does nothing. Let's just kill the birds. Proceed with caution. Proceed with caution. Should be attacking the thing, but instead we're just um, carving up the thing. Where, where does it want me to shoot it? This does no damage. 20 in the face. I guess it's rapid fire. It's too bad. See what I mean about this being like slow and tedious and boring? <laughs> okay, let's go back to the cannon. The cannon was where it was at. There's a cannon there, but that's awfully close. Let's go up here. I assume we can go up here because there's a net. In fact, we can. Hopefully there's a cannon up here. There is. Come on, Loon. You can do it. Abandoned destroyed cannons of ballista. Move to the next station and keep hammering Zora Magdoros with cannon fire. We're doing it. We are doing it. Big damage. Yeah, okay, so it said, um... To use the... The, the ballista to, to shoot the, the birdies. So we were right. Thinking about that. The binder is on top of the barrier. Fire from the ballista when you're ready. Climb up. We're as high as we can go, are we not? What is this? Nope. We have to go over here. One shot binder. All right, we're doing it. Binder post. Success. We've restrained its movement. <laughs> Bullshit. Second binder post. Success. Now, hammer it with all you've got. Hammer it with all you've got. It would just rip that off this wooden platform in, like, all it would have to do was sneeze. Oh, Luna's just kept stocking this. Good job. See how it's five there? Yeah, okay. I think it's five. I'm not sure why Luna's playing a song, but I'm fine with it. It's probably part of the Anjanath gear I, I wasn't aware of. Uh... This has already been taken. One damage. Go back to the face. Oh, <laughs> Lena's awesome, man. Look at her. She's doing her own thing. What a beast. Vata Beast. Alright, we've, we've run out of ammo here. 
Uh, so back down. There was a cannon here from memory. Yes, good. Load this bad boy up. Come on, that's the last cannon. Good job. Have some cannons. Oh shit, someone's come in. Someone's joined us, which is good. The more the merrier. So tedious. Oh, we got another person joined. So the difficulty does um, scale depending on how many people are in the room. Um, so he is now three times stronger than what he was when it was just us. But that's alright. Because we have multiple people. Okay, apparently we're going down here. What's the target's condition? It's still not weak enough to capture, sir. Oi, bird, fuck off. Good. No. You jerk. That's it. Have some, have some bagpipes. Yeah, eat bagpipe, bitch. <laughs> Just knocked him out and he fell down. It's amazing. Off you stupid bird. Jump. Zora Mactros is breaching the first barrier. Oh no. <laughs> I love it. It's just look. <laughs> like Why didn't he do that a million years ago? Zora <laughs> Magdros has broken through! Hunters, grab your transports and proceed to the mounting phase of the operation. Move it, Hunters. Get to a hitching post. Got it. Pulling that sucker now. This is where it really counts, partner. You can do it. Right, I'm just going to buff myself first. Now, now. Alright. How, how do I call my dude? Hit the hitching post. Where the shit is the hitching post? Up this way? Seems like it. Uh huh. The old hitching post. Why couldn't you just whistle from wherever? It's a bit silly. Run its back, old man! Give us some orders! Find the magma cores on Sora's shell. Those are its weak points, so if you attack them, it'll wear the beast down. Ow. Watch out for that magma! It's spewing out of those cores! Seems good. Obviously not that. Uh, do our buddies know where, where to go? I assume they know where to go. <laughs> so let's follow them. I have to say this is cool. Like on the back of it and stuff. It's pretty sweet. Is this a call? Oh no, 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 no. I didn't mean to fall. Nope. It's changing posture. I think it's trying to get out. Stay calm and focused. Just keep looking for 
What the hell is this supposed to look like? We're just hitting nothing. Okay, well. Uh. We've spotted another core on Zora Matros's head. Oh, right. its head. Hunters, make Prince head and attack we that core with all you've got. Which way is its head? <laughs> I'm so fucking confused. Get ready to resupply the hunters. It's time. Understood. I'm gonna assume this is a tent. Watch no. your footing or it'll shake you off! There's there's magma cores. To be had. Now we got a fourth person. Is this one? Oh, but this is its head. Oh. Can I just hit it in the head? Yes I can. I should give myself a buff. <laughs> oh, look at this shiny thing right at the front. This has got to be a magma core, right? I'm not doing any damage to it whatsoever. There we go. Let's give ourselves some earplugs. Now we just lay into it. Smacking the shit out of this thing's face. We need a reverse angle. Not really. <laughs> I've no idea whether this is where we're meant to be or not. <laughs> oh, I killed it! I did it! Go meet up with our, our friends because we're done on the head at least. Um, oh, mining. Why not? <laughs> While we're here, why not? Is this one? It's so hard to tell what the hell is attackable and what's not. Supplies. We got an ancient potion. Nice. All right. Well, these these look like what we were attacking on its head. So maybe we'll have a have a bash at them. Can we even get up there? Uh oh. Uh oh. We've 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 done a fall. <laughs> we've done a fall. Now we're fucking nowhere near where we need to be. Um. I don't know if I can call my my birdie or not, my wyvern. 
so we'll just get some more mining. I think I may need to just do it, do a massive climb again, which is unfortunate because we were right at the top. We can do sharpening as well, actually. Wait, are they the cores on the on the mini map that I literally just saw for the first time? Is this a core? Anything in here? They may they may be dead already. Actually, hmm. meant to be doing? Up more? I guess we'll just meet up with a, with um, our hunter, fellow hunters, right? And just see what the hell they're doing. Because as far as the, uh, um, the criteria to complete the quest, Attack them, weaken the, the Zora Magnaros, we've done. Head to the Hitchy Post, we've done. Destroy the Magma Cores, we've done. Ooh. Is it this? No, this seems to be dead as well. Can we mine on the wall? Because that would be fantastic. No, we can't. I don't think this guy has any idea what's going on either. Um, what about? Oh, that was a really bad shot. What about if we just shoot these? They take no damage. This dude's just getting some stones. <laughs> what? What do we do? <laughs> oh, this is so silly. Climb up that other side. Well, it's getting towards this second barrier, so maybe we just need to. Maybe we just literally need to wait until it gets to the second barrier, and we just did everything really quickly. I'm not. I'm not 100% sure. Follow this guy, see if he knows what's going on. I'm sure something will happen when we get to this wooden barrier. Don't shoot us. Oh shit. We're holding on. Okay, 
Can I attack this? No. Ready your binders! Fire! Black figure oh, up no. in the sky. Hunters, you need to get up on the Zora Magaros' shell right now! A am I on the shell? Traveling via, via Wind Drake. Nope, apparently I'm not. A monster! Some unknown monster has appeared on Zora Magaros' shell. Melissa team, get ready to provide support. Hunters, on the Zora's back now! Well, this is cool. It took way too long to get here, but this is cool. No, it's not Garen. My bad. Um. Come on, back in position now. Aim. Fire. This guy! This guy's great! He's from the first! Master! Oh shit. No way. Okay. Well, screenshot caption. Uh, it was just as useless as the other quest I was talking about. Just way more cinematic and way more like, you know, big budget, epic, whatever. But just as boring and useless. So glad that's over. Um, we got a few Magdaros pieces though, which is cool. Probably won't be able to use them for forever. But. Level two. The cutscene. I I did a thing. Apparently, I broke five parts. Of course I did. <laughs> I had no idea what was going on the whole time. <laughs> I remember just breaking its face. That's the only thing I remember doing. That was worth like anything. So, it, all right. So if I did three things. Those other two guys must have known what was going on even less than I did, because they would have, like, they didn't get anything. So they must be like, what are we doing? Oh, as long as this uh, hunting horn guy knows what he's doing, I don't know what I'm doing. But apparently I did. So.
So that should put us into um, rank 5, I hope. And now we can probably do the um, the Horizon Zero Dawn quest right, to get the Pelico around. watcher gear. Let's get council awesome. underway. First, your reports. Where do we stand right now? We're fucked. Since it breached the Great Ravine, we've lost track of it, sir. The situation has made it quite difficult for quite us. Quite difficult. However, I think we have a chance to salvage the situation if we can pick up its trail on the other side. We've got some good news from the field team on that front. Tectonic movement from when Zora passed through created a fissure in the Great Ravine. That fissure is our ticket to catching up with the beast. There's no point. We exhausted our supplies during the last operation. Even if we did track it down, there's no way we'll be able to pull off anything of that scale. It's true. Hmm. Then what should we do, Commander? Have some biscuits. We'll have to send some a tea. ship to the guild. A ship? But with the skies and seas the way they are. It doesn't matter. We cannot proceed without notifying the guild of the situation. We should send word and wait for their decision. Captain, can I count on you? Never you worry, sir. <laughs> I've been watching the sea churn and waiting for my chance to tame her again. It seems that the fissure in the Great Ravine has not only given us a path, but an opportunity as well. Together, we're going to brave whatever lies on the other side and find Zora Magdaros's trail. Hunters, head to the Great Ravine as soon as you're ready. Oh, we're doing it. May the Sapphire Star light your way. Dismissed. Ooh. Health booster. Hey, partner. Let's go on an expedition out in the Great Ravine. I'll tag along. I'll tag along. Well, we'll have to do that next time. Um, but there's a few exclamation marks, so let's get rid of them mm. while we're still going. That black monster. We've encountered it in the past. Nogagante. 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 Nogagante's arrival and subsequent disappearance always conceded. Uh, coincided. Coincided. My god. With a certain event. That's right. The Elder Crossing. I had my suspicions, but this latest appearance proves there's a connection. I wonder. I wonder. Seems we're not only the ones with a perennial interest in Zora Magdoros. Okay. Nogagante. It's like that Adelante song. <laughs> hey, bud. We got some new products in stock. Now that you uh, capture preparations all uh, wrapped up, how about grab some products supplies? in stock? And since you're heading out, there's been no better, never been a better time. What do you need? I need all the things, guy. Like, all of the things. Um, la -da -da. Oh, we got barrel bombs now. Very nice. Let's go buy some more trap. Oh, we have no money. <laughs> we have no money. Okay. Um, we can fix that, though. That's that's pretty easy to fix. Uh, ammos. Blast coating we can buy now. That's really good. Alright. Nice. Uh, we'll go over barrel bombs and stuff later on. Um, let's just get all of this <laughs> researchy stuff out of the way. A new limited bounty is available. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Expires in six days. Alright. How do we... But we don't know how to do it. <laughs> we literally have no idea. <laughs> uh, let's just put a... That in there and mushrooms. That'll do. Let's go talk to this guy. Hmm. See if we got any more yes. research points. Which we did. Uh, we're at level 2 for him. But it doesn't really do us much. What do you want? Greetings. Oh, you've come to talk with me. How nice. Actually, I have a little request lined up for you. It's called Royal Relocation. I've been researching ways to cultivate more types of insects and fungi in ancient tree. Good. Uh, but the queen has played herself squarely between me and the samples Coming I need. Now. Once you've solved the problem, I can get back to the bugs. Oh, and you'll love the results of this research, I guarantee it. Hunter Rathian. Shit yes. Awesome. 
Stop making Rathian gear. That is good. Oh, man. Uh, this is our dude that we can collect honey from. We still have three things to go for that. Three rounds more to go. Um, let's go up and talk to... I think it was the canteen that had a an exclamation mark. It was. Poking up the more uh, canteen with more thing. Getting yoked in the forest. Okay. Deliver two wyvern eggs. So we have a few of those quests. Um, is there a quest board around? Oh, there's her. She's a quest hey, board. Hey, partner. Hey, partner. Uh, it'd be under optional, I think. So I'm still to do these two, obviously. And then we've got getting yoked in the waste, which is uh, deliver an egg. And now we have getting yoked in the forest, which is delivering an egg. So depending on uh, how much... This is the quest that we need for the Horizon Zero Dawn stuff. So we're not quite there yet. Um, depending on how much, how long this investigation or expedition or whatever it is to the Great Ravine takes, uh, maybe next episode we'll do that and some egg hunting. Um, and then that way I can show you what that's all about. Either way, we'll leave it here for now. Uh, oh wait, no, never mind. There's one more exclamation mark. Uh, I've got new stock in. I've got new stock. Oh, your your stock shit though, woman. Look. Oh, yeah, I could buy a bone blade off you. Woo! Or I could buy bone armor off you. Woo! <laughs> so, yeah. I don't know. They're, they're always useless. Um, and actually, quickly, before we before we finish up, I'll show you. So, if we sell equipment, for instance. Uh, no, not sell equipment. Sell items. And we go to our monster parts. Uh, we can see that we have, like, a shitload of uh, whatever this is. Monster bone L's. They sell for 400 any each. We have 13 Anjanath nose bones. So say we sold like five of them. There we go. We got 4K. Uh, there is much, much better ways of making money. But if you're short on money, you need like just a little bit uh, quickly. That is obviously a way to do it. Someone's sent us a guild card as well. So we'll just accept that. Use HR28. Sure, proceed. Why not? Okay, we'll leave it here. Uh, as I said, next time we'll go out on the expedition into the Great Ravine. And depending on how long that takes, we may also do uh, an egg quest as well. Well, that was a bit of an eh episode, it's got to be said. Um, but that's just the way those older fights are, unfortunately. Either way, I hope you're enjoying it. As always, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.